Tonight, Baltimore City State's attorney seeking a new trial for Adnan Syed, who is serving a life sentence for the killing of his ex-girlfriend, Heyman Lee. These are just like little, little cosmic steps for him getting closer and closer to being home and coming home. Interest exploded in Adnan's case after the 2014 podcast Serial raised questions. No one ever has been able to provide any shred of evidence. And it had anything but friendship towards it, like love and respect for her. And I had no reason to kill her. Heyman Lee and Adnan both attended Woodlawn High School. In January 1999, Hay disappeared. Here. Her body found buried in Baltimore City's Lincoln Park. Adnan's brother exclusively telling WJZ's Vic Carter. Police were, didn't do their job. They were just fixated on Adnan, so they wanted to point everyone towards him. The case against Adnan relied largely on the testimony of one man, Jay Wilds, who claimed Adnan asked him to help bury the body. He said, the police told me all of that. So, you know, this guy's now on the record of saying that I just made up stuff. Adnan's childhood friend, Rabia Shadri, wrote a book on the case, devoting years to her friend's freedom. How do you walk away from somebody and say, well, too bad for you, you're innocent, but you're going to die in prison? Walking away meant letting him die in prison, and there's no way I could have done that. In 2016, a Baltimore City Circuit Court granted Adnan a new trial, but the state's highest court reversed that decision in 2019. Now, after an investigation, Baltimore City State's attorney Marilyn Mosby's office says they found flaws in the case, including authorities withholding vital information from his defense. I was surprised, frankly, to see them point out the misconduct of the detective you know, who was involved in this case. And pointing towards two alternative suspects. Sounds like they actually are hoping to make an arrest of the actual killer in this case. The motion lays out the case really beautifully as to why he deserves, at a minimum, a new trial, um, if not just being exonerated. Wow, that was Annie Rose Ramos reporting. Now, prosecutors are continuing to investigate this case, but in the meantime, they're asking a judge to release Adnan Syed from prison.